guys. Good morning. We missed day 21 yesterday, so we're going to do 21 and 22 today. But 21 is mercy for the world. Yesterday, or last time, we saw how the faithful humility of Mary and the shepherds was rewarded with the opportunity to be the first people to meet the Savior. Any guesses who God would have chosen next, Nathaniel? No. Would it be the king? Would it be Caesar? Would it be the high priest? It was actually none of these people. Mary and Joseph took Jesus to the temple. Got all ours lined up there. Mary and Joseph took Jesus to the temple in Jerusalem to be presented to the Lord. There they were met by a man named Simeon. Simeon. The Bible tells us that Simeon had served God faithfully. He was waiting for his people to be rescued, and God had promised that he would see the Messiah before dying. In Luke chapter 2, 28 through 35, it tells us, Then he took him up in his arms and blessed God and said, Lord, now lettest thou thy servant depart in peace according to thy word. For mine eyes have seen thy salvation, which thou hast prepared before the face of all people, a light to lighten the Gentiles, and the glory of thy people Israel. And Joseph and his mother marveled at those things which were spoken of him. And Simeon blessed them and said unto Mary his mother, Behold, this child is set for the fallen rising again of many in Israel, for a sign which shall be spoken against. Yea, a sword shall pierce through thine own soul also, As you can see, that the thoughts of many hearts may be revealed. As you can see, we have guests. We do have guests. What guests do we have, Nathaniel? Um, We're getting filled with gas at the same time. Grammy and Beep are here. Isn't that exciting? Mm -hmm. They came in yesterday afternoon. Simeon knew the prophecies well. He knew that Jesus was to be born a light and to bring peace. He knew that Jesus was the salvation of his people. He knew that Jesus would bring mercy to the Gentiles. The Gentiles are anyone outside of the people of Israel. Over and over again, God has been merciful to the Jewish people despite their failures. Now through Jesus, God's mercy would not only be given to the Jews, but to all people. That's great news for us since most people were not born into the Jewish lineage. Read Luke 2, 36-38 to find out who else got to meet Jesus. There was one Anna, a prophetess, the daughter of Phenuel, the tribe of Asher. She was of great age and had lived with her husband seven years from her virginity. She was a widow of about fourscore and four years, which departed not from the temple, but served God with fasting and prayers night and day. And she, coming in that instant, gave thanks likewise unto the Lord and spake of him to all them that looked for the redemption in Israel. Like Simeon, Anna was faithful. She was in the temple every day, worshiping and praising the Lord. Her faithfulness was richly rewarded as she got the incredible privilege of meeting baby Jesus. Like the shepherds, Anna couldn't keep the good news in. News this good had just had to be shared. Mercy was granted and restoration was on the way. It wouldn't be much like the people had imagined it to be, but for those who were willing to open their hearts, it would be most, the most incredible thing to happen in all of history. And the homework is to draw up the story of Simeon and Anna. Pray and thank God for his mercy. Ask him to help you faithfully seek him with all your heart. All right, let's do our story. Let's do our drawing. So we have Simeon, so we have Simeon and, and Mary. Okay. Mary is holding the baby. Oh, okay. Mary. I'm showing him to Simeon, huh? Mary. I like it. Nice work. Mary's going down there. Mary's going down there? Yeah. And Bing. Wow, that sounds exciting. Oh no, we didn't cut Mary. Is this baby Jesus? So, no, so this is baby Jesus. In Mary's hands, she arranged with Simi. So, Andrew. That's awesome. Andrew, what's yours all about? And you got black Mary. You got Mary in there too? He taught Mary. Good for you. So it taught Mary. Yeah. So that's day and, 21. And it, day on time. Yeah. So it, and I don't keep stuck in. Good job. All right. Good job, buddy.